Hello, and this week's question is from Robert. I have hundreds of photographs and would like to find a utility that would allow me to assign a camera name to many files at the same time. I found a utility that will allow for date and time changes, but not for camera maker. So far, my only alternative is to change each file one at a time. Well, thank you very much for your question, Rob. And there is indeed a way. Now, Robert in the email also talks about the way that you're able to rename multiple files at once. So to do that, you highlight all of the files you want to rename and you rename the first one. So if I call this certificate, you can see that all of the others get renamed at the same time. Now, what Robert was talking about was the camera make. And the camera make, if you go into properties and go into details, you can see all of these additional properties. And these are called metadata. So one of those includes the camera maker. And you can type in the camera maker of a particular graphic. And that's what Robert was alluding to. So let's say this is the Nikon one. You can tell I don't know anything about cameras and click OK. So next time we go into it, you'll see that it has the Nikon one. And you can also see what camera model it is by clicking on the more up near the top and scrolling down and finding your camera model and camera maker. And there you can see my Nikon one. So what Robert is trying to do is not to have to go into each individually, go to properties, go to details and type in the camera maker. And he wants a utility that will allow him to do that himself. And you have a utility, it's called Windows, Windows Explorer. It's for OD3 and you've got it, and that's great news. So what you need to do is to highlight several TIFFs all at once, and then go into the properties, file properties, and go into the details, and you can see here the camera make and the camera model. So if I edit one of those that is highlighted to Nikon 1 and click OK, you'll see that all of them become given this new property of Nikon 1. And you can do the same with the camera model. So if I change the camera model to the 1-2345, you can see that all six files get the same camera model. So you can do that all quickly, all easily. And then if you use a program like Filecats Professional, you can then, and I'll just click up on the um, image data. You can then catalog that and get all of that data into Microsoft Excel so that you can then interrogate it yourself. So here we go. In, that was in real time and you can now see if I scroll across, there's the camera maker, the Nikon one. So I hope that was useful for you. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll see you on the next video.